Once you've finished learning and memorizing a vocabulary category, it's time to put your newly acquired knowledge to the test. But don't worry, we keep it fun and playful. On the last page of your vocabulary practice presentation, find the practice icon. Click or tap on it and you'll be taken to the matching game. The matching game will display 10 pictures chosen randomly from the category you were just practicing. In the center will appear a word in Hebrew. You can always click it if you want to hear how it is pronounced. Spaghetti. When you see that any of the pictures surrounding the word is a match, simply drag and drop the word onto the matching picture. With each successful match, you'll be rewarded by a smiley icon and a word of praise from your Israeli teachers. Nehedar. If you've made a mistake, you'll get an X icon and a word of support, encouraging you to try again. Nasushuv. You can make up to three mistakes for each word. This will be indicated in the upper left corner of the game. Since the game may include up to 15 words, five of the words may not have a matching picture. So if a word appears that doesn't have a picture, just click on the skip button to move on to the next word. The skip and back buttons can also be used when you're simply unsure about a specific word and would like to come back to it later. Okay. In this game, we've made nine correct matches so far. Let's see if we can get the last one now. We'll skip this word, and this word, and yes! We've scored 10 out of 10. Good job! The last thing to remember is that you can also access the matching game from any of the lesson pages under the Test Yourself section. When starting the game this way, you'll first need to choose one or more of the vocabulary categories to play from. Click or tap here to start, and you can now test yourself on multiple categories.